right. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to Gravity Throttle Racing. My name is Aaron Tate. Welcome to beautiful Chavano River Canyon. And my name is Richard Gear. Today we have a doubleheader. The fans are excited. Let's get right into it. In the first three rounds of head-to-head -head competition, we saw some excitement, some unexpected. Now we have Captain Obvious versus Max Chemist, followed by Daphne versus Ricky Juan Bobby. You're looking at our competitors for the fourth head-to-head -head competition. First up, let's take a look at Captain Obvious from the country of Australia. He is driving a 2016 Honda Civic Type R from Team Down Under Racing. He is going up against, from the Donetsk People's Republic, Max Chemist, driving a 2021 Porsche Taycan Turbo S from Team Max DPR Racing. Here they are, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go. The drivers are up at the Condor, ready for the first. Now keep in mind, the first to win. Three races moves on. Boy, it's tight. Look at them go. Past the Eagle's Nest. Oh, there's a tangle up. And there goes Captain Obvious. Oh, sliding out. It didn't take long for these two to get into it as the first race commenced. They both look good over the Weevil Gap, clearing it nicely. But all throughout the course, very close to dead even. Captain Obvious comes in and clips Max Chemist there. Max doesn't give up. He stays right there afoot with Captain Obvious. They will have to continue now as a restart. And race fans, we are sorry to say that today's doubleheader will only be one camera view as the pandemic has impacted our camera crew. That's okay. We're moving on. Race two. Once again, oh, Max Chemist. They were dead even, but Max flipped the car over. Let's see how Captain Obvious does. He's got a free run. Quite smooth through the snake pit. In and out of Grave Digger's tunnel. He's going to pick up his first win. With the 360. And through the finish. Parts of this course are going to bring an early end to our competitors. The first being the Weevil Gap. They must be able to land execute without spilling and flipping their car. Max saw defeat early on. Captain Obvious is ahead, one to nothing. Here we go now with race two. Back at the Condor. Captain Obvious has the early lead. It's very tight now as they pass the Eagle's Nest. Oh, Max Kimmis swerves out. Captain Obvious has the lead and Max is trying to stay in, stay in contention going backwards. Oh, there's a slide out. There goes Max Chemist in reverse. He crashes. I think he crossed the finish line. I think so, and it looks like Captain Obvious made sure that he did. Let's move back here and see. Captain Obvious has slid out. Max Chemist seems to be driving forward and backwards. It doesn't matter. But one thing is for sure. When he gets to the bottom of the egg beater, he is totaling his Porsche. Still, he's even the score. We are now tied one to one. Let's take a look. Get ready for the next race. And they're back up at the Condor, and that Porsche still looks brand new to me. Max has the early lead. He's looking good over the gap. He seems to be extending that lead. Nice drifting onto the highway. He's separated himself from Captain Obvious now. Let's see if he can have a clean run the rest of the way. Nicely done over our Mills Bridge. Oh, <laughs> just as we expected, he flipped it over. But that will give him the lead now, as Captain Obvious is stuck on RP Mills Bridge. Captain Obvious has his work cut out for him. Max Chemist, able to navigate most of the egg beater, still finds himself upside down. But with that rounded top, he can finish and has the lead, 2-1. to one. They're back at the Condor. Captain Obvious has the inside lane. It's very tight now. Boy, they're dead even. Drifting onto the highway. Whoa, Max does a reverse spin. Nope, now he's out of control, and Captain Obvious has the lead. Around the corkscrew. Drivers are trying to find their momentum back as they're heading now over Chavano River. Here comes Max Chemist. He tries to sneak in on the outside. Again tries. Whoa, it looks like Captain Obvious has won this that race. That was a very close race, and... Max Chemist almost buttoned it up. 
He gets caught up the top as he was drifting, but look at that wonderful spin. Gets the lead, but as quickly as he gets it, he loses it again. And Captain Obvious took advantage of that. He charges right on through and has the lead as they make their way down Lewis Hanford. You gotta love how Max Chemist almost is able to take the lead there on the outside. Our Captain Obvious sails through and ties the score two to two. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, you've heard me say this before. This is it. The next one to win a race wins and moves on in the head-to-head -head competition. Captain Obvious has the lead. Max has got to catch up. Oh, it looks like he got knocked out at the top. There's no sign of Max Chemist as Captain Obvious makes his way over the Chavano River. Looking strong. Over the egg beater, sliding through for the third win. Congratulations to Captain Obvious from Australia. Max Chemist had the lead. Look at how he has trouble over the Weevil Gap and takes that lead. Nice drifting by Captain Obvious. Staying in control. But it looks like Max Chemist took it a little bit too hard as Captain Obvious does a beautiful patented slide through the finish line for the third victory. Congratulations to Captain Obvious who takes the third victory and moves on in the competition head head number four. Ladies and gentlemen, because of a technical glitch, Daphne versus Ricky Wan Bobby will be in our next video. Are you tracking?